My name's Steve Meller. I am a fitness expert. I train people throughout London. I also run the gym at Claridge's uh, Hotel. Um, and I spend my days kind of going between um, the hotel gym there and uh, delivering sessions, and then sort of throughout central London with, with clients, um, some celebs, and then just everyday people as well from all walks of life. A typical day for me uh, starts around 5.15 or 5.30, depending on my first session. I head to my first client, and then I'll generally work from about 6 till about 1, um, so 6 a.m. Um, just after lunch. And that's my first meal um, of the day. So I have a good meal, generally eat um, a sort of paleo-based diet. And then from there, the day uh, carries on with a few more clients, um, depending on the day. Some days, again, I have more clients, or I head down to uh, where I train at a CrossFit gym, CrossFit Perpetua, and that's kind of my time to just disconnect, unwind, and have like a bit of therapy, as it were, to, to kind of finish off the day. If you want to exercise and keep exercising the next day or the day after, it's important to look after yourself immediately post-workout. What you can do at home can, can help you. Hot baths can, um, using um, menthol and Epsom salts, like the Achy Muscle Super Soak is a great product. Um, using uh, things that's gonna increase blood flow to your, uh, to your muscles. My belief is that consistency is, is, is a t determining factor in all of us. So whether you are consistently poor on your diet and consistently don't exercise, or the opposite, um, you eat uh, a healthy diet, and you exercise, and that is that you are a product of those things. So I try and make sure that everyone that I work with and myself never does anything radical. So it's a progressive process and you lead them through the steps of change. In terms of nutrition and get the meeting, just things that come out of the ground. Build your foundations on real produce. I like to kind of open people's eyes to the things they probably turn their nose up at or don't do and maybe the thing they should change. That's a big motivator for me and then when someone buys into that and they go on that fitness journey with you um, and to lead them through that is that's that's the best thing. Like I love coaching. I absolutely love coaching people. That that feeling of showing someone how fit they can be is is you know, is kind of what I love best about my job.